Hi, in this video I want to address a problem that a lot of beginners are experiencing and that's how to copy and paste using selection tools. I have explained this before in previous videos but people write me comments and messages saying that it doesn't work for them so I'm going to go over it again and also a little bit later in the video I have a question for my subscribers but before that let's see how we can copy and paste using selection tools. As you can see here I've opened this image and this image is a layer and in our project right now we have only one layer and I'm saying this because you may have more than one layer and in that case the one that it's active will be the one that you're going to copy information from and you can make a layer active just by clicking on it and when you made the layer active you can use the selection tools to copy information from this layer and I say this over and over again because this is one of the top reasons why something is not working the way it's supposed to work you're just not on the right layer and another big reason for problems is you made changes to your two options you forgot about them and then the tools are not working correctly so you can just go from here tools options menu and reset only the selected tool or reset all the two options now let's make a selection and this time I'm going to use the ellipse select tool and I want to select this moon over here once you've made the selection you don't even need to apply it but if you want to do that you can just press the enter key and then go to the edit menu and from here select copy or use the keyboard shortcut ctrl c and then go again to edit and use paste or ctrl v once you do that you'll see that over here we have a floating selection pasted layer now there's a few things we can do with this one of which is to just grab the move tool and position this moon over here and then I can right click and anchor the layer and this will make this moon part of this layer this image and I can no longer rotate it or move it or position it here in this image so it's now part of this image now let's undo two steps using Control Z and right now we are at the point where we just use the edit paste option and the next thing you might want to do more often is to make this floating selection into a new layer so you can do that by clicking over here or you can right click and select the to new layer option next grab the move tool click and drag this over here and you see how this works so we have the information copied using the selection tools from this image paste it on a new layer and we can do further editing if you want to and that's pretty much all for this copy and pasting I hope that it was useful and if it was subscribe like the video and for my subscribers I have a question do you think that I should redo my older GIMP 2.6 tutorials first of all the audio and video quality is not very good second especially for beginners even slightest changes in the interface can be confusing and another thing is that I speak very funny in some of them I probably still do but I'm trying English it's not my native language so it's kind of difficult for me to explain things and make tutorials in English so let me know what you think in the comment section I appreciate it and that's it for this one Bye.